How do I run a Perl script from a Jenkins pipeline? Here's today's starting point. I have a Jenkins LTS controller version 2.346.1, and attached to this controller, I have a Linux-based agent that has Perl installed on it. There's also a sample repository. The link for that is down in the description. And let's go ahead and take a look at this sample repository. I have a Jenkins file, and I have a hello.pl file. If we take a look at the Jenkins file, what we can see is that we're going to run our declarative pipeline, agent any, and since we only have a single agent connected to this controller, it's going to use that agent. First off, I like verifying what version of Perl that I have, or if Perl is even available. So if for some reason Perl was not available on this agent, then this stage would fail and the rest of the job would fail. So it's a quick way of verifying whether or not the tool that you're expecting to use actually exists on the agent. Assuming that that works, then we're going to run Perl hello.pl. If we take a look at hello.pl, what we have is just a very simple Perl script that's printing out hello world. Before we go to our controller, let's go ahead and get a link to our repository. So we'll copy that. And now let's go ahead and go back over to our controller. Let's create a new item. We'll call it Perl. Click on pipeline. Click OK. We'll scroll down, change this to pipeline script from SEM. Change SEM to get. We'll paste in our URL. We'll change our branch specifier to main because that's what I have in my repository. And our script path just stays Jenkins file. Let's click on save. And now click on build now. And as the first job cranks up, let's take a look at this. We're cloning our repository. We run Perl dash version and we get back an answer of 526. And then finally, when we run Perl hello.pl, we get the expected output of hello world. If you have any questions or comments, you can reach out to us on Twitter at CloudBees. If this video was helpful to you, give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to CloudBees TV yet, why not? Take a moment, click on that subscribe button, and then ring that bell, and you'll be notified anytime there's new content available on CloudBees TV. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next video.